Hello and welcome to another video here with Mimioni for Final Fantasy XIV. This time I want to look at another minion, but this one is a little different in the way you obtain it. Rarely during the course of farming Titania Extreme, which I have a guide on the channel if you're interested you can go and check that out, you will occasionally see the Dancing Wing item drop. This item then has a use for various things, most notably you can craft the Titania themed bar and housing item. However, you can actually use the Dancing Wing without having any crafting classes at all to obtain a brand new minion. If you note here, we're in Ill Meg, and if we fly over to X 20.6, Y 36.3, you will find an unusual vendor. You may have seen this during the progression of the quest lines. It's even marked on the map. If you actually don't see this vendor available, then you will need to first complete the side quest, A Mystery Best Left Unsolved, which is unlocked throughout the main course of quests in the main quest hub. This vendor then will accept one dancing wing item from Titania Extreme in exchange for the giant beaver minion, and this is what he looks like. Summon your giant beaver minion, a mystery better left unsolved. A mysterious being that appeared at Faisal Ran. Whatever may be the truth of its identity, some mysteries in the world are better left unsolved. Let it be enough that everyone has their heart's desire. The hidden text reads, Something tells me that's one more mystery better left unsolved. A quote there of Elise. The minion will react to emotes if you wear your Mammoteer Pet Collection title, a handover will feed the adorable beaver from your hand, and a pet emote will make him jump and jiggle around. This minion is certainly one of the cutest obtainable. Ever since we first saw this in the Shadowbringers benchmark trailer a ways back, it made people wonder how we would get it, Thankfully, after a pretty brilliant piece of questline writing, you can get this little guy from a fairly simple exchange item, and of course the dancing wing is actually saleable on the market board, so you might find it quite cheap at the moment considering the amount of people doing it. I like the idea of exchanging boss items at hidden vendors behind quest lines. I feel that it gives the world a bigger sense of mystery, and hopefully they do this more in the future. Anyway, thank you kindly for watching, and I'll see you all next time.